What is up, party people? It's your boy with an algorithm video, so your boy has the day off. And even with the day off, I still feel tired, you know. You work those 14-hour shifts, and then you finally get the day off, but you wake up, and it's like, then I gotta get to work. And, you know, you still haven't decompressed. It takes like a couple of days to decompress. But your boy has the day off today, so hopefully I can decompress in less than three days, because your boy's gotta go back to work. But, Let's talk about Algorand. So Algorand, you know, our boy from Brazil, Freddy Stanchi, he's head of marketing for Algorand. He sent out a tweet yesterday. And in that tweet, there was like a clue, a little code about an announcement that's going to be made in a couple of days. And it's supposed to be like a big announcement. And, you know, based on that clue, it sounds like it's about USDC, the USDC stablecoin on Algorand. So we know Algorand and Circle has that partnership that you create that USDC stablecoin and stablecoins are really a big component of DeFi, you know, because you need to be able to take your, say you made some money in DeFi, put it in a stablecoin so it doesn't continue to fluctuate. It's pegged to um, something that will maintain the value of the US dollar. USDC is interesting because they're, they are, I think they are the only one that is completely pegged to U.S. assets, U.S. Treasury notes, um, U.S. dollar, whereas other stable coins are pegged to, say, another stable coin. I mean, they're pegged to another coin. They, you know, they they rely on algorithms to kind of maintain its value, which I personally don't like because you know we saw what happened with the Terra Luna incident. You know, they they pegged their one stable coin to another coin that they created and when the bear markets come in and people start selling off and panic kicks in, it loses its pegs. USDC is pegged to the US dollar, you know, US assets. So it's it's better, you know, if the US is doing okay, um, the, the USDC stable coin will, will be okay. So that's, that's a nice thing that I like. And USDC seems to be having competition, you know, Tether for example. And with the ability of other companies to create stable coins, they're seeing more competition because even though these algorithmic stable coins are not as stable as USDC, people are still using them. So USDC appears to be needing a way to make themselves more attractive. And not too long ago, I think they, they created a bridge between one USDC, say Ethereum to Avalanche. I think it was Ethereum and Avalanche. So they bridged it, and I think this next announcement is going to be about Ethereum bridge to Algorand. So we're gonna see probably a bridge from Ethereum to Algorand. And for Algorand, this is good news because Algorand has been trying to attract people who build on Ethereum because they, in their mind, they see that if Ethereum developers see how easy and how inexpensive it is to build an algorithm, they're liable to bring more people in. So this is good news for both USDC and for Algorand, and we have to wait a couple of days to see what the announcement is about. Anyway guys, I'm not affiliated with any of these companies. Until next time, peace out, safe investing.